We are literally two days away from this government being shut down, and it's incumbent on the majority in the House of Representatives to get something done, the Republicans. But today they're spending all day doing um, an inquiry into the impeachment of Joe Biden. Yeah, they're all about this. Hasn't been any evidence, no witnesses. They've got three witnesses today, none with any direct evidence. They're just talking about theory. And in fact, one of the witnesses today in the impeachment hearing, Jonathan Turley said, yeah, there's no evidence to impeach Joe Biden, but we should still look into it. Again, what's important to remember is we're looking into impeaching a president where there's no evidence that he's done any wrongdoing at all. That's egregious enough. But then you throw in the fact that we're a little tight for time on the potential of shutting down this country. Maybe the House of Representatives should get together and do, I don't know, what they're supposed to do and govern this fucking country and make sure our people and our country are safe. The Republicans can't agree on a budget. It's not even about the Democrats and Republicans. The Republicans can't fucking agree on anything. And while Rome burns, we see Jim Jordan and James Comer fiddling or having an impeachment inquiry into Joe Biden. It's an absolute joke. And it's a very lame attempt to try to smear Joe Biden. They've been trying to do it for five years. It hasn't fucking worked. When do they say, you know, maybe we should try something different? <laughs> Yeah, you keep it up, motherfuckers. You're drowning yourself for the 2024 election every goddamn day. Your Lord and Savior is done. He is cooked. And the Republicans are proving every day that they have no business in the business of politics because they simply can't fucking govern. But you go ahead and have that impeachment inquiry with no evidence. I'll be anxious to see what you come up with, which will probably what you always come up with. A lot of nothing and a lot of fucking embarrassment.